Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix your sound not working on your Windows PC. So we can go up to settings right here and select this. And then go on down to where it says system and go to the right and go to sound. And then make sure you have your device selected on here. So for example, uh, my Self 700 G2 PlayStation headset is selected with this little blue black dot right here. And I know it's connected. Now, if you don't see your headset listed on here, there is a connection issue either with a USB cable or Bluetooth. So you want to go on over to add device right here and just go to Bluetooth and add your device. So your headset may be connected, but it's not connected to your computer at this moment. So you might have an issue where you have to reset your headset or remove it from your place or from your computer and then re add it. So you want to go to Bluetooth and devices and locate your headset under here and just remove it and then reconnect it uh, with add devices. There may have just been something wrong. Otherwise, turn off your headset, restart your computer and just reset everything. And it should show up under this list now for sound. And then you know you're good to go. So what you want to do now after that is make sure your volume is up enough. Now you're going to have a volume slider on your PC right here. Then also somewhere you can probably have a little dial on your headset. So turn up the volume on your headset, turn up the volume on your PC. And then once we have everything connected, let's go on over to our device now and make sure it says don't allow right here. You can actually disable your headset if you go to don't allow and it will pretty much disable it from working on your computer. So when it says don't allow, this means uh, you can still use it on your computer if you go to uh, this option right here. You're currently using this device, so you don't want... It's kind of confusing the way they word that. I wish they would just word that a little bit better so you know <laughs> it's not disabled. So then we can go on down to the different formats or whatever, and we can just test it out and make sure it's working in our left and right ear. It looks so good. And then we got some enhancement effects. All right, so once we go through here and we just kind of set that up, we want to go on down under here to more sound settings. And I'm not sure exactly what your guys' issues are, but I'll just go through all the generic things under here. Uh, go to your device now and go to uh, set device default. And if you plug in a different device, it should still remain connected to your main device if you set it as the device default. And then go to properties and go to levels. And here's your speakers and your enhancements. So you can increase the bass sound. Uh, maybe it's not loud enough. Then there's like an enhanced audio option under here, a room correction, virtual surround sound. And then here's advanced. Uh, there might be something on here we can apply. And you can have different uh, things on here as well. We can turn on Windows Sonic for headphones and just hit apply. So look at these different things as well. And once we have this selected, we want to go back, back to this screen. And then we can go to the volume mixer. And we can just select the output device on the top for our system sounds. So make sure you have your headset on here. And then our microphone is the input device. And we can do this game specific too. So for Steam, exam for example, just go to your device under here and select it. And maybe like it's not working in a specific game, just select this, uh, the game once it's opened up on your computer and select your input device and your output device specifically for that game. Then once we get the sound mixer all good, uh, we want to go back to where it says privacy and security on the left here. And then scroll on down under here and locate your, your microphone is going to be the one we want to go to. Then also we should have a different option uh, for everything else in terms of our camera, our email, etc., phone calls, contacts. So let's just go to our microphone. So if you got to connect a headset, you probably don't give access to your microphone for that specific app. Just make sure this is turned on and we can actually use it. So if your microphone's not working, then we go on to go to search and go to device manager right here. And we should be able to see our input devices and output devices right on top of the first section and go to your speakers. You can see your speakers under here. We can right click on this and go to properties and just go to on a still device and then update the driver right here. And you can see this is working good right now. It's connected and we could try just completely disabling it and re-enabling under here as well. Now, if your device isn't showing up, go to view and go to show hidden devices and you can see your hidden devices. For example, my headset microphone uh, is not working for some reason is connected. 
but uh, the microphone is not connected for some reason. So I'm going to have to reconnect my device and then uh, maybe my computer as well. So just go through this section right here and see if you can update the drivers, get this to work under this menu as well. And you can scan for hardware changes too if you just connected something in. And you could probably disable the device too if you don't want like a light camera microphone to be working. Just disable it under here. So yeah, look at all those different options in sound settings. Make sure your headset's connected first and make sure you have uh, the correct auxiliary cables if you're gonna be connected with those on the side and whatever port you're trying to connect to isn't disabled under device manager. You can see under hidden devices, everything that's connected there. Just make sure everything is turned on. So hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech videos coming up next on Your Six Studios.